Hey dolls, so I am back. So I'm coming to show you dolls how to do this wig. Now this is actually a headband wig, so I will show you how to wear it in just like the normal headband way. And then I came up with, let's try a flip over method with no headband because sometimes I do get tired of wearing headbands with these wigs or maybe sometimes I just don't have a headband that matches good with my outfit. So if you wanna see where this hair is from and how I did the two different headband styles, then keep on watching. so here is the bag for this hair so this is from Allie Grace if you can see real cute bag and it's satin which is nice I like to have these to store the wig in they did send me a headband which is this tropical navy blue one with like some flowers on it but I used my own headband when I actually did apply a headband and then the wig actually came inside of this bag so this is a curly hair unit, 26 inches, 180 density, and this is actually the kinky curly texture, okay? And then we have this little pamphlet in here that kind of tells you how to like wash and care for the hair and all of that. And then they also sent some wig caps in brown. It really doesn't matter what color because you're really just going to put it on the back part of your hair. So it's not going to be seen anyway unless you wanted to save it to use with like a lace wig or something. But yeah, so this is how my hair looks and my hair is still like kind of curling up okay dolls so stay tuned to see how i got this style and my normal headband style all right so low-key i need to go ahead and wash my hair so i just went ahead and did this little quick baby hairs and slick my hair back and put a stocking on so i'm gonna go ahead and pop the wig on this is gonna be like the fastest easiest headband tutorial ever this hair is kinky curly so i would suggest that you go ahead and co-wash it off camera comb it out put some conditioner in it because it was a little dry and i did get some shedding from the hair um the ends were dry not the top part but yeah and kinky curly let me just tell y'all i only have tried kinky curly like one time in my life so this is probably my second time because it was just so dry before um and it just wasn't giving me that curl that luscious juicy kind of curl that i like but I was like, let me try it again because it's been years and years since I tried Kinky Curly. So I got it in a headband wig and I said, I'm going to see what this hidden for. So I just popped her on. She doesn't have any combs in her, which, you know, may be an issue for some because it a comb, the combs do give you more security. I'm gonna fold my headband in half. I just like to do that because I feel like it gives you more room to leave your hair out, if you will. Um, and to do my baby hairs, all I did was just use some eco styling gel and just kind of slicked it back real fast and easy. Um, so yeah, and I just have my two little swoop baby hairs and then boom. So, I kind of want to try something. I said I was going to keep this simple, but I kind of want to try something. So, we're going to see in just a second. But we'll start off with this style. So, the hair is actually really pretty. Let me see. Can I zoom y'all out? Y'all are zoomed out. Okay, I'm going to bring y'all down just a smidge. And let me move my camera. All right. So, this is how far the hair comes down. And you can see the ends look nice and curly. Like, this is not giving me kinky curly vibes at all. Whenever I first went to co-wash it, well, I took it out of the pack. I was like, this is why I didn't like kinky curly hair. I remember why I didn't like it and, you know, why I haven't tried it in forever. But after I just washed the hair and co-washed it, that's all I did was put some conditioner in, comb it through, rinse it out, and then I put some more in and let it uh, dry. Just put a little bit. Um, and I just hung it by the ceiling fan and let it dry y'all it's still a little wet but it is so pretty like I love these curls so I'm gonna bring y'all back up a little and we're just gonna pop a headband on and try it out this way yeah I did not think I was about to like this hair because after I took it out the pack I was like nah this this ain't it okay so now I have my headband on and you can see this is a cute fast style especially like if your hair needs to be washed or something you know the front of your hair you can usually finesse it to make it look pretty good but I got a little dry scalp so I'm getting a little bit of flakes but it's not nothing crazy 
but it still looks so cute like it's real cute but I want to try something with this hair um just for the hell of it okay so be careful whenever you are taking it off because it does not have comb so it's wanting to slide back and it's also getting stuck in my headband okay so I'm gonna just pull this up I'm gonna pull it up real high And then, let's see. I'm going to pull it up real high and then I'm going to fold this band underneath the wig, if you will. Where you can't really see it. And then, I'm just trying this, y'all. I've never tried this before. I'm going to get some hairpins so I can hold it in place, kind of more so how I want it. But y'all could kind of see what I'm trying to do, right? I'm trying to do like a quick little flip over method. And you know, sometimes you just don't feel like putting a headband on. like, Or maybe you don't have a headband to match your outfit for the day or whatever. I'm just going to try this. So I'm going to bring this part up. And I'm going to put a, poppy, a hairpin in to hold this in place. Okay, so now we got that side. Now on this side, we just have to make sure that we do this part real good because you don't want to be able to see your tracks. But you also don't want to see the band. Okay, so... I'm going to just pull it up and I think I'm going to pin it over here. Place a pin in. And I think this is going to work good with the curly hair. Give me a minute y'all. I'm not done. So now I'm going to take out a little smidge of my hair. I was trying to do it where I didn't have to but... I feel like I need to take out a little bit of my hair. All right, y'all, so this is how you can turn your half wig or your headband wig into a kind of like half wig flip over method vibe. Um, and I think it turned out so cute. Like I was not expecting to do this. I really was just gonna do the one style, but then I was like, I gotta give them something different, new and innovative that I haven't done with the headband wig because I feel like I just keep coming up with different cool stuff that we could do with these headband wigs that's really easy and effortless and you know it's not really having to put any heat or anything on your hair so if you do have naturally curly hair this will work really well with like a curly type wig if you have straighter hair then you know you may want to use a straight wig or whatnot my hair is natural um it's not relaxed so my hair does give like a nice little wave effect um and it's like curling up and blending into the hair if y'all can see that. Um, but yeah, you could do your baby hair as a different kind of way or whatever. I just kind of went with what I already had. Um, and try to see, you know, like what it would come out like. But 
yeah and then you can also kind of like push some back if you want to put some more hair out here in the front you can do that as well or you can kind of like swoop it over whatever you really want to do like this these wigs it's no limits to it like you could come up with so much stuff and y'all i really like it like it's so cute i haven't had curly hair in a while so let me back up okay so now you can see the hair in its entirety and i'm gonna turn around so this is how long it is So that was real easy you just have to make sure that none of your tracks are exposed or anything like that but yes this is super cute so y'all let me know what y'all think about this wig if you like it better with the headband or if you like this little flip over method that i just came up with off the top of my dome let me know and if you have any questions leave those down below and don't forget to like comment and subscribe bye dolls